Good morning, everyone. Well, we were lucky enough to have our hotel at an actual golf course, and so we're starting off the day at the driving range, which is a good start to any day. Choke down in the club. All right, keep my eye on the ball. Uh, we went into the trees. Is that a good one? No. That was okay. So it's a weekend warrior tour, day one here in Pennsylvania somewhere. Day started off right because there's a taco bar for lunch and if you know me, you know that I love tacos more than most other things. Great start to the day. Here we are in Center Hall, Pennsylvania for a fair. I'll tell you what fair it is here in a second. There's an app for that. The Grange Fair. in heaven. It's legit. We come from New Orleans. You taste it, you will know the difference. It looks right. Smith that pressure. This is every day on tour. If you want to run into my wife, just hang out at the nearest ice cream shop on tour. Hey, is anybody on crew, I mean, anybody in the crew on radio? She's radioing to Nate to ask if he would take a fish back to Nashville for her if she went along. Is any of the crew on radio? So if I want a fish in the fair game, who wants to take it back? I thought you'd get to eat it. Bye, girls. So Abby does want a fish? Everything all the way around. Thank you very much. Have you tried the fish yet? It's delicious. Okay, Nate, I'm going to win you a fish. <laughs> So if we make one in, we get to eat the fish? That's your choice. She did it on the first one! I think I want to name him Gene Parmesan. Now we're going to take him to the Will Fry Anything booth. <laughs> Alright, where to next? I've always wanted a bus fish. Oh! He might survive Are those through the night. Pets? You can. You stumble the same line. Excuse me, this one's trying to escape. Nice goldfish. I named him Jean and I won him on the first try. Congratulations. Thank you. Why was his name Jean? I don't know. I looked at him and I thought he looked like a Jean. There you go. He's a good fish. They go great with real Jean. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Over a year ago, our merch man, Nathan, aka Potato, swore that if someone bought him a male romper, he'd wear it. Well, guess who bought a male romper for Tater? Follow me. Hey, Tater. Yes. Do you remember giving us your word? All right, hand it over. <laughs> you know what the crazy thing is? My fiance has one almost exactly like this. Uh, Humphrey would like you to sell merch in this. <laughs> we can make that happen. It's a place to heal and a place to hurt after a long week of hell. It's like Sunday church. You'll hear dirty jokes and the gospel truth a jukebox choir singing in a corner booth we're here every weekend bring your burdens bring your pain everybody's welcome at the church of the dive bar saints yeah well the bar top's been baptized Spilled beer and cheap wine Ooh, This congregation doesn't judge But they take your keys if you had too much They got your back here I can't believe this is a, this is dry And you, you brought permanent housing to here <laughs> Maybe y'all should stop letting the Amish choose your laws 
And let me tell you something, if you're offended already, this is going to be a long show for you people, too. So buckle up, Pennsylvania. I made the mistake of running to the tour bus during the drum solo. And I probably brought my microphone with me. If it's not there, boy, it's anyone's guess. <laughs> so Chance is kind enough to... Hey, he found it! Hey, he found it! Thank you. Oh, yeah. Anyway, as I was saying... <clears throat> As I was saying, as soon as all this is torn down and on the, on the bus, we're going to have to head out because we have a 16-hour drive to Minnesota for a show with Reba McIntyre. Sure could use a win right now. 